What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello and welcome. And if you're not, thank you for coming back. I'm Becca and here on my channel, I cover all things fashion. I do a lot of hauls and I, of course, always give you my very honest review. For today's video, I have a huge Lululemon fall haul and I have a lot of new arrivals in today's haul and I am super excited for this video today because A, I love fall clothing. Like fall and winter clothing is my absolute favorite and Lululemon has been releasing a lot of really great items and colors that I have been been loving. So I'm super excited to talk about them today and tell you what I feel like are the must-haves for fall. Before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like this video and if you like my channel. And as always, I did link everything that I'm talking about in the description below so you can click on the link and it will take you directly to the website. All right, let's get into this haul. Starting with this sweatshirt that I'm wearing right now, this is the scuba funnel neck and this is in a new color called Dramatic Magenta. This is in a size extra small small. As soon as I saw Lululemon slowly start releasing different items in this color. I was really hoping for a half zip scuba just because I love this color. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you know that I'm going through a purple phase right now where I just love everything purple. So I have been buying everything purple. I had to have this scuba. Now this is in a extra small, small. I have been going in between sizing with the scubas. I've been purchasing medium, large, and then extra small, small. And then I just decided, I think I like the extra small, small best. And as soon as I put this on, I feel like this just runs a little bit smaller than my other extra small smalls. So now I'm just really confused and I'm thinking about returning this and getting a medium and large. Maybe it's the color, it runs a little bit smaller, but I do think I'm going to return this and purchase a medium large instead. I absolutely love the scuba funnel neck. If you've been watching my channel for a while, you probably already know that. If someone were to ask me, Becca, which oversized scuba would you recommend? I always say the funnel neck just because there is no hood and it doesn't feel like it's pulling your sweatshirt back when you have it on. This is perfectly oversized. I love the fit of this. I also like the length because it's not super cropped. It's more like waist length and it's super soft on the outside. It does have thumb holes. It is fleece lined and you have the half zip with the hair tie on the zipper. I'm not sure how many scubas I have now, but what I do know is I wear them in the fall and winter all the time. They hold up really nicely for me and I feel like they keep their shape as you wear them. And honestly, I feel like they just fit better and they just get better with time. So I love all of my scubas and I love this one, obviously because it is purple. And when I like a color, I feel like I need everything in that color. So this is the next sweatshirt that I have. And this is actually from the men's section. And this is your PSA, not to sleep on the men's sweatshirts because sometimes they are better than the females. And I have found a lot of men's hoodies that I actually really like. So this is called the Steady State Hoodie. And this is again in dramatic magenta. And I purchased this in a size medium. As far as sizing recommendations go, I wanted it to fit oversized. So I decided to purchase a size medium. If you want it to be more fitted, stick with your true size. If you want it to be a little bit oversized, maybe go up one size. But if you want it to be extra oversized, definitely go up two sizes. I honestly think I would like this in a size large. So I am going to return this and purchase a size large. I was really excited about this sweatshirt because when I was reading the reviews about it, a lot of people were comparing this to the lounge full hoodie in the women's section that they actually don't have available and hopefully it comes back this year at some point. But I do have the lounge full hoodie in the full zip and I also have it in a hoodie and I love that sweatshirt. So I was very excited that this could potentially be the same and I would definitely agree that it is. This material is a cotton fleece blend material and I think it's very soft on the outside and it's fleece lined on the inside and I would consider this a medium weight sweatshirt. So it's not super thick, but it's also not a really thin material. I feel like, again, it is most comparable to the loungeful hoodie if you have tried that from the women's section. This is just a very simple sweatshirt. This is what the front looks like. I will say, this hole right here is a little bit snug to put over your head, especially if you're a female and you're trying to avoid makeup that you have on. But I feel like if I sized up another size, I wouldn't have that issue. But that's something to keep in mind. The hood is really nice and lightweight, so it's not tugging at your sweatshirt when you have it on. You have a kangaroo pocket. You do not have thumb holes. And I just really love the overall fit because one of my biggest complaints with sweatshirts that are oversized is the bottom band is tight. I hate when sweatshirts are loose around the body and then the band is tight. I want it to fit just like the body of the sweatshirt. And that's why I really like the lounge full hoodie because it doesn't have 
the tight band at the bottom. So I'm very happy with this. This is extremely nice quality, so I personally can justify the price for this. This is a sweatshirt I know that I will grab all the time just to pair it with leggings and maybe even jeans. So yeah, I am very happy with this, but like I said, I am going to return it and purchase a size large. Moving on to the next sweatshirt that I have. This is the last sweatshirt that I have in this haul. I just, I love fall and I love sweatshirts, so I am a sucker for a really good sweatshirt. But I was really excited that Lululemon brought this sweatshirt back because it was actually one of my favorites last year. This is called the Scuba Oversized Funnel Neck Full Zip. I already have this in two different colors. I have it in black and a teal color that I purchased last year. And I wore both of those all the time. And they actually released, I think, three colors this year. And one was black and the other one was almost that same exact teal color. And then they released Bone, which I do not have. It's kind of like an off-white color. I purchased this in a size extra small, small. That is my true size and that is what I would recommend in this full zip. I definitely would not size up because I feel like it'll run too big. This is actually a true oversized fit if you stick with your true size. I love this funnel neck so much. It is the same material as all of the other scubas so it's really soft on the outside and it has the fleece material on the inside. What I really like about the scuba full zips is the overall fit. It is designed to be an oversized fit. It definitely covers my bottom and I love that the bottom band is nice and straight. It's not tight and it aligns perfectly with the body of the sweatshirt. So all around it's perfectly oversized. I also like that it has a funnel neck because like I mentioned earlier the funnel Funnel neck is my absolute favorite, so you don't have a hood. You do have pockets with this, and you also have a full zip with the little ponytail holder. And I think this has thumb holes as well. Yes, it does. I wore my other ones a lot last year, and they're very versatile for me, and the quality has held up really nicely. I always wash mine on cold and hang them to dry, and they have all held up really great. So I would definitely recommend this sweatshirt, and I would purchase it now while it's still in stock because I remember last year it was sold out all the time once they had it out for a couple months then you could just never purchase it because it was always sold out so I would recommend purchasing it now while it's still in stock. Moving on to the three pairs of pants that I have I'm going to start with the ribbed soft stream pants. These are in the color espresso and I purchased these in a size 6. My other soft stream pants are in a size 6 and that's my preferred size. I like to size up one size because I want them to be a little bit looser so that's why I decided to purchase these and these actually I feel like run a little bit smaller than the regular soft stream so these do not fit as loose as my regular ones so I'm still happy with the size 6 though and I would recommend sizing up one size I feel like the size 6 in the ribbed pant feels more like a size 4 with just a little bit more room if that makes sense I feel like espresso or java or any brown color is perfect for the fall in winter just because you can pair it with a lot of different colors like a maroon or maybe a bone color or even purple because I feel like that purple color looks really good with this as well. So as far as the details go, they are still a high rise fit. You have two pockets. It is the same draw cord as the regular soft stream pant and I believe the length, yeah, it's 32.5. As far as the length goes, I feel like it's the same as the regular soft stream pants and I would would say that if they are too long for you, you can always take them to your local Lululemon to have them hemmed. I am not going to have them hemmed. I feel like they're perfect on me and I don't feel like they're too long. I love this ribbed material. I honestly think I like the ribbed version more than the regular soft stream, especially if you're someone that is concerned about stains on the soft stream pant. I personally have never had any issues with water stains or anything like that on these soft stream pants, but I feel like if you purchase the ribbed material, it'll probably hide those water stains a little bit better but again I've never had that issue so I can't really speak on that. The material is so soft just like the other soft stream pants and I feel like really the biggest difference with these pants is the ribbed material and just the overall fit is just a little bit tighter. I absolutely love these. I love this color and yeah I am very excited for these because I know I will definitely wear these a lot and these will go perfectly with that scuba funnel neck that I just showed you in the color bone. Moving on to the next pair of pants. These are called the Align High Rise Wide Leg Pant and the 
35.5 inch inseam. Now, they have already released these before. I have them in black. I have done a review on them, but I believe they were 31.5. And this is the same thing, they're just longer. I purchased these in the color Espresso and in a size four. I am a true size four in these pants. I would stick with your true size. I was really excited about these because even though I really like the Align Wide Leg Pants the first time they came out with them with the different length, I feel like they could stand to be a little bit longer and I'm 5'3". So I know anyone that's over 5'4", they definitely would not work for them because they would be way too short because they hit me right at my ankle. So I had to try these and the overall fit is the exact same as the other Align Wide Leg Pant. They are a high rise fit. They are in that new Lou material so they are brushed on the outside and on the inside. They feel like second skin and they are very stretchy and comfortable. The biggest difference is obviously just the length and I love the length. I'm not sure if I'm going to have them hemmed or not. I would say they're a little bit long, maybe an inch too long for me. I don't feel like they're so long where I'm always going to be stepping on them, but I will say if you're someone that's 5'2 and shorter, then you will probably want to have them hemmed or maybe you just try the other version that's a little bit shorter. But I love the wide leg pant. I feel like they're very flattering on. You can dress them up or down. I love to wear them casually. They're so comfortable. They're basically the aligned legging just in a wide leg version. Moving on to the last pair of pants that I have. These are relatively new and I wanted to give them a try even though I'm not a fan of the jogger version, but these are called the scuba wide leg pant. And I purchased these in the color dark forest and these are in a size four. I originally purchased these in a size six and they were too big. I mean, they were fine, but I feel like I wouldn't want to wear them out because they were too big and baggy. So once I return them and purchase a size four, I feel like the size four fits me perfectly and they're perfectly oversized. So honestly, I feel like these run big and I would stick with your true size. Now I mentioned earlier that I'm not a fan of the scuba joggers just because I feel like they stretch out over time. They're not very flattering. The waistband is a lot tighter than the overall pant and they just were not a jogger that I wanted to lounge in. So I was a little hesitant about the wide leg pant, but I was pleasantly surprised once I tried them on. Now, these are a high rise fit. You have a draw cord right here. You have two pockets. The material is the same scuba material, whereas the cotton fleece fabric on the outside, they're very soft and they are fleece lined. I would consider these a medium weight sweatpant. They're definitely not lightweight and I wouldn't say they're the thickest sweatpants that I have, but these will definitely keep you warm because they are fleece lined. Now I really like the waistband because they're not too tight. They fit perfectly and I really love the overall fit of the wide leg. I also really like the length. I feel like these are not too long on me. Now when I sized up to a size six, I feel like the size sixes were way too long and then once I purchased the four, I feel like they're perfect. I just love the fit of the overall leg. They're very comfortable and cozy and these are definitely a sweatpant that you want to wear out and about, but you also want to lounge in. These are the pants that you would wear like all day long and not want to take them off and then wear them into the next day, if you know what I mean. And they are really nice quality. I am very happy with this color. I'm trying to purchase other colors that are not just black or navy or maybe gray and find other neutral colors that I can match other colors with just because I feel like I have a lot of those colors already. So I am happy with this color. It's a really pretty green color and I'm a huge fan of it. I actually have several items in this color. So I love the scuba wide leg pant and I'm definitely considering other colors and I would definitely recommend these. And that includes everything that I have in this Lululemon haul. I always like to mention two items that I would recommend purchasing first if you can only purchase two items. And I'm going to say first the scuba wide leg pant and second is definitely going to be the scuba full zip. Thank you so much for joining me in this review. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below and I will see you in the next haul.